Hello and welcome to Impact Africa and we are still at the Crank Hydro Club with the car, classic car and motorbike 2020-40 and I've got Mr. Harvey here who is going to tell us about this wonderful car. I'm not even going to say anything about it. Tell us about the car first. Okay, what we have here is a 1901 Benz Ideal. This car is actually very close to home. It was bought new by the owner of Timer Hall in 1901. So it's actually right back as its original home. What's it now? 123 years yes, later. Yes. Uh -huh. It's the third iteration of Benz that we was made by Carl Benz. It has three forward gears. The previous models had one and then two. So the big improvement was having a three-speed transmission. Mm. Single cylinder and it was intended to carry two adults and two children. And Carl Benz himself drove a 1902 model like this as his own car right up until his death. So there's something good about this history and to have it home here. And it's extremely important that it's kept. Mm. And the Crank Handle Club has got this car in trust now. So it will be preserved for future generations. Wow. So I can see it has two, three what does what those what three it? pedals do nothing like a modern motor car okay. two of them are brakes one is reverse gear two brakes and one reverse <laughs> wow that is interesting to them what and is that steering one? that's, that's the steering gear shift. that's the clutch Yo. you actually need more hands than feet to drive it <laughs> that is amazing so now for the the club for you I, I, you know in terms of the club being the owner what has been what you've mostly been proud of you know about this particular car well it's a two-edged sword looking after the car because the club's got it in trust yes i don't own it but i have to fix it if i break it yes but in exchange i have the opportunity or the privilege to use a car like this and that's why it's so important that the car doesn't belong to one person mm. it's held in trust by a club and the club's committee is responsible for it so it, it's, it will perpetuate a lot better. How did you manage to restore it? Because it still drives. Still drives. Well, so you fix it you when it breaks. Right. <laughs> okay. Anything, <laughs> any parts that break, you make new ones. I was just going to ask because just, are there parts for it anymore? No. I'm sure there's none. So you have to make the it front, up. The front front tires are motorbike tires. You can buy those. Okay. The back tires don't exist anywhere in the world. One of our club members made us ru solid rubber tires. Wow. So for you looking after it, how often do you take it out for a drive? We, we try to take it out twice a year. Twice a year. It comes okay. to the show, we do a, a run for old cars once a year and we try and take it out on one more run so that it doesn't stand and gather dust and without getting used too much. So is it kept in a garage? It a lives in our clubhouse. Okay, all so right. So the club keeps it in trust. To protect yeah. it from... Yes. Anything. Okay, wow. So for you, I just want you to just share, how did you get into cars, generally? I Sorry, grew up, I need to ask I that grew up with cars, okay. not as old as this one. Okay. <laughs> and then somehow or other I joined the Crank Handle Club and with that I got interested in this car and I've been looking after it for quite a few years now. Wow. So okay. has there been a lot of people coming to see? What have they been asking you about it? main thing is about how do you drive it and it's, mm. it's <laughs> because it's yeah because i know two brakes are not all there yeah mm. so interesting okay so i'm okay. going to get you to close because i know we're running mm. out of time if you could just give words of encouragement to young people out there because i know all of you all volunteers you do this every year and if you could just help give you, words you're of just too late we had two of our junior members here who are still very much in the beginning of high school, we're learning to start this thing this ah, afternoon, so they okay. both fired up about No, we're it. coming back in next year. We we're will go, back. We'll make them start it for you next year. Yes, we show. will be back. Unfortunately, I've just seen them leave, otherwise we'd okay. have called them now. Okay, no, we will come, we'll, we'll come back. Thank you so much Fine. for your time. All right, well, that's all we've got time for. Till next time, stay safe, stay blessed. Remember, God is love. Mr. Harvey says, and I'm supposed to be sitting on one side, so watch me. 
I guess this is the stop. And then if I have a passenger, I guess the passenger is supposed to sit there. So, and then you go like this and like that. And, ooh, I'm just a simple flu, but this is a city place. So you can take for two children. Okay, you see? So you're doing out with your family, wife, or husband. I'm the one. So, yeah, there we go. Thank you for the time and good luck to Crack and Club for all they're doing, what they're doing, you know, looking after being custodian of all this wonderful, old, amazing cars for generations. Thank you.